Welcome to 31 Days of Your Scrapbooking Q&As. Today's sponsor is True Scrap Kids. Grab your kids, grab your craftiness, and come join us online July 27th, truescrapkids.com. Today's question comes from Kim, who says, I'm really enjoying your series again this year. Thank you for hosting it. I have a question for you. I'm seeing more and more Project Life collections on the market. I'm a traditional 12 by 12 scrapper. You have your ear to the industry, and I was wondering if the manufacturers are still going to be continuing with the 12 by 12 format. I sure hope so. Thank you again for a great series. Thanks, Kim. And this is a great question, particularly since I'm just back from the Craft and Hobby Association show, which is the CHA show in Las Vegas. It's the largest industry trade show for the craft and scrapbooking industry. And I got to see all the latest and greatest. Now, my answer to you is two parts. One, there is definitely a trend towards the project life or the three by the pocket scrapbooking, whatever you want to call it. Project life, pocket scrapbooking, page protector scrapbooking. There is definitely a trend. We're seeing more and more of the journaling cards. Um, the items that are, are, are scaled to the three by four, the four by six to go in the pockets. But at the same time, I still saw plenty of supplies that could be used on a traditional 12 by 12 or eight and a half by 11 inch page. For instance, Lawn Fawn is one that comes immediately to mind and they are creating traditional 12 by 12 scrapbook paper, but on one side it'll be a pattern, on the other side is journaling cards that can be cut apart and used either on a traditional page or on um, in your pocket page protectors for Project Life or something similar. And I'll show you a photo right here from their latest catalog. You can see on the one side there's the green pattern, on the other side is the three by four um, cards that you can use. Now that brings up something additional that I want to make a point to emphasize, and that is that even though these are sized for the pocket page protectors, there is nothing that says you cannot use Project Life products on a traditional 12 by 12 page. Now I didn't see any manufacturer except for Project Life, Becky Higgins Company itself, that is exclusively um, addressing this kind of pocket page protector. Everybody else that I saw had something that was appropriate for traditional scrapbookers. And while they may be adding things in that would be appropriate for the pocket page protectors, you can combine and play with those. I do not do Project Life in the traditional sense, but I definitely would use these cards on my traditional scrapbook pages. So that's something else with simple stories. Um, they're a company that has embraced the project or the pocket page protector approach from day one, but I often use their products on traditional pages. So that's something to keep in mind. Even though we're seeing this trend towards the three by four, this is stuff that we can use in any way we want on our scrapbook pages. So don't feel like just because everybody else is going in one way that you have to give up what you're doing. Or And also don't feel like you can't use these products in different ways because you could create a really cute mini book. You could use them to mount your photos on to give a border around and um, cut them apart, die cut them, punch them. You do not have to use them just in the pocket page protectors. And that's something to think about with all your scrapbooking supplies. Just because it's intended for one purpose does not mean you can't use it in a hundred different ways. Thank you so much for your questions. And I'll have some more information coming up on my blog at layoutaday.com that will talk about the latest and greatest that I saw at CHA. Bye.